Welcome to the Future Media Lab of Tsinghua University. I'm Rick Dunham, co-director of the Global Business Journalism Program at Tsinghua University. I've been a professor at Tsinghua University since 2013. Before then, I was a reporter in the United States for 35 years. I was a Washington correspondent for 29 years, covering the White House for 17 years. And I was a Washington bureau chief before I came to Tsinghua to join the Global Business Journalism Program. I was delighted to join the program in 2013 because it's one of the best journalism programs in the world and it is the finest business journalism program in English and Asia. So today's topic is the Global Business Journalism Program at Tsinghua University. I wanna to talk to you a little bit about the program, about its history, about its students, about its alumni, and about the great opportunities there are educationally and professionally for students around the world to join our program. So first, let's talk a little bit about our journalism school. The Tsinghua School of Journalism and Communication was founded in 2002. It's among the top journalism schools in China, and it is the most internationalized of all journalism schools in China. It's the only journalism school in the country that has fulfilled the accreditation requirements of the Accreditation Council on Education in Journalism and Mass Communication. So what's the Global Business Journalism program about? It was launched in 2007, and it's the first program in China on global economic trends that's taught entirely in English. Our students come from all over the world. They represent 73 countries on six continents and every province in China. GBJ has established itself as a leader in studies of trailblazing Chinese companies, of emerging capital markets, and international commerce. Students learn data mining, they learn multimedia publishing techniques, business reporting skills, a wide range of skills that are helpful in the journalism world or in business and finance. Our program is a partnership, partnership between Tsinghua University, Bloomberg News, and the International Center for Journalists. Bloomberg News is our funding partner, and the commitment comes from the very top. Michael Bloomberg, the founder of Bloomberg News, is a strong supporter of the Global Business Journalism Program. And Lee Miller, one of our most beloved professors, is a senior uh, editor at large at Bloomberg. He's taught here since 2007. He's considered one of the top data journalists in the entire world. Bloomberg offers a lecture series where it's reporters from around the world come and talk to our students about business issues and about journalism issues. Bloomberg, in addition, offers tours of its bureau to our students and training in its television studio and other facilities. More than 100 of our Tsinghua students have earned the Bloomberg uh, Market Concept certification uh, since the program was created. In addition, at least 20 of our graduates have been hired by Bloomberg, more than 80% of them women. The other partner is the International Center for Journalists. ICFJ is based in Washington and serves the world. Since 1984, ICFJ has provided valuable programs and resources around the world to journalists from more than 180 countries. And ICFJ has managed GBJ since its inception in 2007. The ICFJ network is 130,000 journalists strong on six continents around the world. And ICFJ offers our students training tips, free professional workshops, networking opportunities, and job leads around the world. Our facilities are some of the best for any journalism program in China. Bloomberg News has donated 10 of its Bloomberg terminals for our students to use for access to real-time financial data, uh, the latest news stories, and business analysis from around the world. Our Future Media Lab offers modern equipment and software that our students can use, and the newly, gener the newly renovated Journalism School building contains a modern television studio and state-of-the-art technology that's gonna be available to our students. Our program has faculty from around the world, including international journalists with experience covering business and economic issues, and top Chinese academics uh, specializing in both journalism and academic, uh, academic research. We offer a combination of hands-on training and, and business journalism courses. 
The GBJ program offers both Chinese and international students a Master of Arts degree with a specialty in global business journalism. And since 2007, there have been about 20 international and 20 Chinese students attending GBJ each year. Uh, GBJ has trained more than 550 students during that time, and more than 500 have graduated with master's degrees since the first, time, the first class of international students graduated in 2009. So let's talk about some of the students and what they have to say about GBJ. Angela Fung, 2020 graduate from Canada, says that GBJ pushed her to believe that with dedication and perseverance, she can accomplish limitless things. Hanan Gilani from Pakistan talks about how GBJ has enhanced his communication skills and has helped him to craft compelling narratives. Zhao Mingjun from China has talked about the many opportunities that GBJ has given her to communicate with teachers and, and students from around the world, and she calls it a window to the world. Tudor Finneran from England talks about how this is the perfect mentorship and partnership and how the combination of the students and the faculty uh, give an opportunity for learning and for project development. Corazon Sheppy from the United States has uh, discusses how the GBJ trains future journalists and provides insight, business insights with journalistic prowess that is unparalleled. So what are the course requirements for GBJ? There are four core courses, business news writing and editing, multimedia reporting and news writing, business news data mining and analysis, and economics and accounting basics for journalists. That gives you a good basis both in economics and in the journalism skills that you will need to succeed. Other basic courses include media research methods, intercultural communication, because we value our multicultural element, and a workshop on academic training and ethics. Our elective courses are wide ranging from hot topics in the global economy to business news data mining and analysis. And every student is required to complete a professional internship and to attend a course on literature review and, and their proposal for a thesis or for a journalism portfolio project for their masters. Our alumni work at in a wide range of jobs around the world. Uh, most work in media, either in traditional media or for new media companies. But others work for technology companies, for entrepreneurial startups, for public relations or marketing. Some work for, for government agencies, and others work for global agencies such as the United Nations. A few examples, Bryce, a 2018 graduate from Burundi has worked for Star Times TV, which covers African issues in Beijing, and he has uh, interviewed uh, leaders from around Africa and covered stories in four different languages. Uh, Jarshin Zhou, Zhou Jiaxin, a graduate from China, uh, works for the China Global Television Network, CGTN. He covered the uh, coronavirus outbreak in Wuhan for CGTN and he's covered wars in the Middle East and in Ukraine. Our 2015 graduate Zen Su from Singapore has become one of China's best technology reporters and now works for the Associated Press in Hong Kong. While Zhao Jie, 2016 graduate from China, is a social media editor at China Daily, where she and her new media team have won China's top journalism award for their innovative new media coverage. Her classmate Jordan Dahl from the United States is a news editor at LinkedIn, where she specializes in environmental and green technology issues. Betsy Joles, our 2020 valedictorian, has become one of the leading freelance journalists in Asia. Based in Pakistan, she's covered stories all across South Asia and in China. Two of our graduates have become prominent in publishing and in uh, documentary filmmaking. Our 2010 graduate Park Jin Moon from Korea made global headlines for his uh, Korean television series called Super China about the economic rise of China. While Eric Fish, a graduate from the United States, uh, wrote a very well-received book called China's Millennials about the generation of students and young adults who grew up in the early years of the 21st century. And he's working on a newer book about Chinese students uh, studying in the United States. 
For our alumni, we have an active network uh, and we try to have uh, annual reunions in Beijing at Bloomberg News and around the world. We've had reunions from Washington to Hong Kong. It's easy for our alumni to connect with each other. On our globalbusinessjournalism.com website, uh, we have an alumni section where we describe the uh, graduates on six continents and we have LinkedIn connections so that it's easy for a student or for a graduate to connect with one another. So we stay active not only on campus but after people leave campus. Our professors are influential in media, both in China and around the world, appearing frequently on television as news analysts and experts uh, on business and journalism issues. Uh, we have been featured in news articles from the United States to China, and news media has praised GBJ's uh, effectiveness, our innovative teaching methods, and our expertise uh, in business and economic journalism. Our students work hard, but there's also time for play. Uh, we have uh, regular uh, social activities from our annual Halloween party to movie nights. And we also have serious business. We sponsor academic conferences. Our students attend uh, different meetings with industry leaders on campus and around Beijing. Uh, we have uh, field trips to uh, media headquarters and to different companies. So what's the scholarship situation? It's something that's very commonly asked by applicants. We have scholarships for our top students who apply. Chinese government scholarships that cover tuition and housing are available to many of the top applicants, but it's very important to apply in the first round of applications to get those scholarships. Other scholarships cover all or some of the tuition costs. But again, it's important to apply early to have the best chance to receive financial aid. Thank you very much for being with us today. We welcome you to join us in the Global Business Journalism Program. If you have any further questions, please contact us by email at tsjcws at mail.chinghua.edu.cn. Thank you very much. Hello, my name is Tudor Finneran. I recently joined the GBJ program at Tsinghua University. So since joining the program, I've had the privilege of visiting Shanghai, Xi'an, Suzhou and Yan'an, and of course Beijing. I did so as part of an initiative to communicate what's going on in China with the Communist Youth League and the Belt and Road Initiative. These two are just a few of the many fully funded travel and education opportunities available to members of the GBJ program. If this is not enough of a reason to trigger some interest, then combine it with our faculty and the best business journalism program in the world. Our two primary international professors are Lee Miller and Rick Dunham. If you don't know who they are, it's well worth a quick Google, but they have in fact shaped journalism in their careers and now teach the best and brightest. In addition to these two, we have the chief editors of Financial Times China and the key leaders within Chinese state journalism teaching classes, taking us on trips and otherwise imparting fantastic knowledge. If you are interested in China, business and journalism, this is the best option. Hello, I'm Irene, first year GBT student and I'm from Indonesia. And I'm Amanda, second year GBT student and I'm also from Indonesia. You know, China's economy is growing super fast and that's really, really grabbed my attention. I wanted to know and experience what's really happening in China. And when you have the chance to study in China, of course, you want to go to the best university. And yeah, that's why I'm here at Tsinghua University. Yeah, my experience also same with Irene. When I first got my admission letter from Tsinghua, I got this question a lot from my friends. Why China? It's quite obvious, China rapid economy for past decade amazed me. Then I also come to know that China and Indonesia relationship are getting stronger, especially in economic partnership. Understanding China economy is a key today, and GPT offers incredible opportunity for that. As the first English business journalism program in the mainland, this program is so much more than just classes and lectures. It's a gateway into the exciting world of business. We got to visit Bloom Bloomberg, one of the top international media companies for business and market news, talking with multiple journalists and getting their insight and advice has been invaluable asset for me. 
Yeah, and we also have the access to Bloomberg Terminal in our lab. This means that we are learning with the best tools and we dive into the real practice of journalists in the real world. And that's really cool, you know? As a foremost journalist in Indonesia, this major definitely has strength offered. The practical curriculum, the collaboration with Bloomberg, internship opportunities, and diverse classmates from all over the world also learned me to join to global business journalism. So if you are excited about diving into business journalism and getting right work actionist, GBJ program is here waiting for you. We can't wait to welcome you to GBJ. Hello, I'm Hanan from Pakistan. I'm honored to represent the GBJ program. Since coming to Tsinghua, I have witnessed a transformative journey in my English news writing skills. The in-depth analysis and lectures from industry-leading experts who now teach us have been instrumental in my growth. I have not only refined my technical writing, but also broadened my ability to produce quality pieces under time constraints. This experience not only instills confidence in my future in this field, but also significantly enhances my news literacy. The GBJ program is not just about learning, it's about evolving and thriving in the ever-changing landscape of global business journalism and multimedia. The GBJ online lecture series further enriches our learning, connecting us with industry experts and keeping us up to date with current trends. Additionally, the support from our distinguished faculty team has been invaluable. It's hard to capture all the program offers in a couple of sentences, but these aspects truly define the unique and comprehensive experience that is GBJ. Hello, my name is Corazon Sheppi. I'm from the United States and I'm a first year global business journalism student. Prior to my master's degree, I also did my undergrads here. So during my four years, besides the academic aspect that I really enjoy and learn from, I also enjoy the campus life. So if you don't know already, Tsinghua University is filled with resources. There's loads of canteen that I can explore. I think there's about 20 canteen or so and six libraries that I can go and do my homework. Besides that, the campus holds several supermarkets, haircut, shops, post office, and banks. Gyms are also my favorite place to visit. What makes my life on campus so special though, is life in GBJ. Here, we embrace diversity. We have so many international students from 73 countries. In my year, we have students from Thailand, Malaysia, United States, United Kingdom, Canada, Indonesia, and Pakistan. Most importantly, although it's diverse, but that's what makes us a family. I get to experience different cultures and traditions, which bear fruits to finding a lifetime international friends and connections. Thanks to all of our students for being with us today. I hope you'll agree that the Global Business Journalism Program is really something special. We want to thank our program sponsors, Tsinghua University, Bloomberg Business News, and the International Center for Journalists for making this program possible. Since 2007, we've brought together students from all around the world to learn in a, on a beautiful campus at one of the top universities in Asia, revel in our cultural diversity, and we hope that we've been able to produce a new generation of journalists improving the quality of business journalism worldwide. Uh, we hope that you're interested in the program. If we can be, be of any assistance to you, please get in touch with us. If you have any questions, we'd be glad to help you and answer anything, anything that you'd like to know about our program. Uh, we're very proud of what we've accomplished and we hope we can do it for years to come. Thanks very much.